Hello everyone, thank you for joining Remote Sensing and GIS question and analysis session series. In today's question, we'll see how we can able to calculate the area for land surface temperature. So here you will see I have already calculated the land surface temperature. If you want to know how to calculate the LST, you can visit our channel because Gadamudi channel is there. There are many videos regarding the LST is there. So if you'll see here, there is one video, automatic extraction of land surface temperature is there. After that, if you want to calculate the LST for the Landsat 4 and 5 and 7, you can use this video, calculate the land surface temperature. So there are so many videos regarding LST. So I will provide the link in the description box from where you can able to access this. So after preparing the LST, we are interested to calculate the area for this. So like, suppose if I'll go to properties, I can classify this image into five classes. Okay, so go to classify and click on okay. So here, suppose I want to classify this into five classes. So I can select the five classes, then select the color, what are the color you want to select. After that, just click on apply and okay. Okay, so these five classes are there. So what we'll do, we'll reclassify these five classes. So you'll see the 18 degree to 27 degrees there. So we'll do the second class, third class, fourth, five, like this five classes will do. So just need to go to our toolbox. In the art toolbox, In the arc toolbox, if you'll see, there is a special analysis tool. In the special analysis tool, there is a reclass and there is a reclassify. So we need to reclassify this image into five classes or what are the desired classes you want to do, you can do accordingly that. Here I will add this image. You can just select and you can drag it or you can also add from here. So now, go to classify and here I want to do five classes. If you want to do manual classes, then you then also you can able to do here manual classes, but I'm interested to do this five classes. So I'll just take these five classes. I will go by default, just click on okay. So you'll see these five classes is there and the number is there. So 18 to 27, this is the lowest LST. So one I have provided and this is the 32 to 45 is there. So I provided a five here. So after that, we can provide an output location means where you want to save this. So in this area, so in this folder, I will save the image by the name of LST, then reclass. Okay. After that, I will save as a dot tiff and just click on the save and just click on the okay. So first we'll reclassify this image. So after reclassify, we can able to calculate the area for this. So reclassification is done. So now we can convert this raster to polygon. So conversion tool is there. The conversion from raster to polygon option is there. So just select this LST reclassify. And after that, provide your output location. So I'll provide raster to poly raster to poly lst and just click on okay so now it is converted to polygon if you'll check there are so many small small polygon is created so on the base of this grid code, we can dissolve this. Okay, on the base of this grid code. So what is this grid code? This grid code is this one that we have selected from 18 to 27. Second is this and fifth number is 32 to 45. So these are the grid codes. Okay, so we'll dissolve on the base of this grid code. So we just need to go to geo processing. And in geo processing, there is a dissolve tool is there. So click on the dissolve. So select this raster to polygon and I will add dissolve and on the base of this grid code, I'm going to dissolve. Okay. This is the grid code and just click on okay. So finally it is dissolved. So we can just open the attribute table. So now you will see this five grid code. Okay, then now we can able to add a new field here. 
by the name of area and just select a float just click on okay then select the area field just right click and calculate geometry option is there so you want to calculate this in what unit that you have to select i'm interested to calculate in square kilometer so i'll select a square kilometer and just click on okay so now you will see this area covering 32 degree to 45 degree is covering this much of square kilometer so 18 degree to 27 degree celsius is covering by this much of area so like this you can able to classify this and you can able to calculate the area for lst okay so it is very easy if you have any doubts you can ask me in the comment sections thank you